just to let anyone know there is an update available for the Retron 5 uh, it's V1.6 or something and we are going to be installing it now so yeah Retron 5 still works no problems no real problems <laughs> so far I've had it for over a month I think we're installing our update here as you can tell <laughs> installation in progress so I'm actually recording this with the Nvidia Shield tablet it doesn't exactly have the greatest camera on the planet Earth, but it uh, kind of does the trick. What the fuck? Sharpen. Sharpen. Listen, NVIDIA Shield camera. Tablet camera thingy. You better sharpen. Thank you. Installation in progress. A reboot is required. Ha-ha! We are shutting down. Congratulations, we're shutting down. Okay. Let's see if it, uh, okay, cool. Yay! Of course, this is not the end of the uh, update. It uh, takes longer than this. You have to make an update request and all this other crap. And we got this Android screen here. Uh, we're updating with that and stuff. So, tra la 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 la. Okay. Now I guess it's gonna reboot with that stupid splash screen crap. Wish you could disable it. That'd be a nice option. Disable splash screen. It's kind of. I don't know. All right, now we must go, I tell you, we must die. All right, uh, anything different here? No, I don't think so, because it wouldn't be, yeah. Um, data file manager. Write firmware update request to SD card. Okay, I'm just gonna check the system information. Yeah, and stuff. All right, so now I guess I have to take that SD card to my PC. All right, so here we are back at my PC with the shaky uh, camera. Um, come on, man, focus. Focus. God damn you, focus. Alright, won't focus. Alright. So. Ha. Ah. Now, where are we? We're trying to. Confirm our update requests. And we need to go with over the bear. Take request blah blah. Download page here. Okay. So now we need to update. We need to install according to the update instructions, blah blah. Alright. Uh file chosen. So you have to put in the stupid capture code. My hand is starting to hurt. Y N H three H three H and then once we uh, do that you will I guess choose the, the file I'm gonna choose it from the SD card straight from the SD card update that request submit and now it is downloading the update.bin file that is necessary for this. 
And now, with this blurry camera, we'll be going to the Retron 5 update thingy. And we will... Yeah, go over there. And... Get rid of that. I'm gonna do that. There we're that. Okay, so just to rem uh, let you know, this is not a tutorial. I'm just doing it. <laughs> there are tutorials on how to do this, so... This is not it. That's why I'm not being very thorough when I talk. <laughs> I'm just installing the update. So now we're installing the update. <laughs> Installation complete. Reboot. Just press the button. And we're rebooting. And then we'll go check the software version for this console. This new old console. Yes, that was me getting a boner. Okay. Splash screen, which I don't like. Splash screen again, which I don't like. There you go. Alright. So, now, we are going to go to the, I think, settings. Yeah, settings. And we'll go all the way down to system info. And we are on Retron 5 application V1.6. Yay! So happy. There you go. Just to let you know, after updating, I'm able to copy my save data back to the Legend of Zelda cart. So, that has never worked before. That is really cool. That is a huge plus. Uh, especially if you were to, say, maybe even try to change the battery inside the uh, uh, cart. Or just if you wanted to transfer that save data onto another cart. And that is cool, because it actually worked this time. It, before, it would just delete it, so that worked. Not to say that it worked for everybody, but it worked for me, and it never worked before, so there you go.